Today, I would like to take a look at the fastest way to export and minify your images from Lightroom. I'm using the latest version of Lightroom. I'm using JPEG Mini as a plugin. I'm also testing it as a standalone application and I'm testing a new program called Space Saver, which could also be a nice option to export your images. Uh, what I would like to do is select roughly 70 images, um, export them first using uh, JPEG plus minification and the Lightroom plugin from JPEG Mini and see how long it takes. For that, we're gonna use a stopwatch application. So I'll start the stopwatch, I say export in Mini. Uh, we're using an AMD Ryzen 9 9300X, which is a very fast processor, especially for file, mani uh, file manipulation. There's uh, 32 gigs of RAM in here. We're now down to, let's say, two minutes, and we're about, let's say, 30% there. And what you'll see, if you look at the export directory, you'll see all the files being in here now. So uh, uh, Lightroom is pretty much finished with the export and it's now minifying. And you'll see one by one, you'll see the images being swapped out for the minified version. Now let's wait. So it took us about three minutes and 45 seconds to both export and minify the files. Uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna uh, put the files in a separate directory so you can see how much they have been minified. We'll now do just a JPEG export. So I'll restart the timer. We are at three minutes 45 and I'll just run a JPEG export of the same files. So the export alone took us uh, until about, let's say five minutes. So one minute and uh, 15 seconds would be about the run, a rough estimate of, uh, of, uh, of this. Uh, now let's minify them. I'm first gonna use uh, a space saver because it saves the files in a separate directory. And let's throw them in there. Let's start at five uh, minutes so we have a good estimate. Here we go. As you can see, I've left Lightroom on. I've done that for a reason because Lightroom also takes up space. That was about 10 seconds. Um, Lightroom also takes up space and I want it to be uh, the same memory usage as it would be just to give it a fair comparison. Now let's open JPEG Mini Pro. Uh, with JPEG Mini Pro, it starts compressing the files as soon as you drop them in. Um, so I'm gonna start the timer and then drop them in straight away. So let's say we start at 15. Here we go. So that took a lot longer, about twice the time it took a, a space saver, roughly 24 seconds. So let's see which ones are the smallest. And as you can see, Space Saver is even smaller. It's, it's almost half the size, which is amazing. Now I would like to do a small uh, quality comparison. I did JPEG mini version. And this is the Space Saver version, big, big. And as you can see, it's almost impossible it's i couldn't find any big differences between the two files so uh yeah it's just amazing that you can compress files this much without any loss in visual quality so uh very cool to see so what can we conclude from this first up if you want to minify your files do it separately don't integrate it into your workflow within lightroom itself it's just a lot slower if you use jpeg mini but the second thing is that Space Saver is both a lot smaller and a lot faster than JPEG Mini is. And it's even a little bit cheaper. I think uh, JPEG Mini retails for about $70, where uh, um, um, Space Saver retails for about 50. Cheaper, it's faster, it's smaller. So it's basically the best option you've got right now. I do hope that Space Saver brings out a plugin version and that it will be just as fast as the send loan application. Uh, so hope to see what they do there. But uh, I'm very pleased with the end results and uh, this really increases workflow time. So, uh, so the question you can now ask is, do you need minified version of your files? It takes up some time to minify them, but it saves a lot of space for you saving them, but also for you sharing them, uploading them to the cloud and sharing them with friends or your customers. Uh, and it doesn't take a lot of time. It isn't that expensive. So I would definitely use a minification program. Uh, so spend some time, uh, speed up your workflow and, uh, and uh, make sure you, that 
that your clients enjoy the smaller files, file sizes as well. SDU when you want to back up JPEGs instead of your raw files. So good luck experimenting with programs. There's a You can experiment with both of them. They've got trial versions. So try them both out and see what your results are. But I'm very surprised with the end result and very happy with them as well. Cheers.